Hello, you guys. Welcome on in. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Hello. How's everybody doing? Um, here's our game sound. What is going on, you guys? Kayla, Lana, great to see you both. Thank you so much for being here. Peach, welcome in. Marjorie, welcome. So good to see so many of y'all. Cynic, Gina, hello, welcome in. So many tea party members in the chat today. We love to see it. I love to see it. Teacup, welcome in. How are you today? By the way, to all members, if you haven't joined the Discord, you can now link your YouTube and Discord if you're a member and be able to use the same emotes we have on stream um, in our Discord. So I just wanted to throw that out there. All the instructions are on the Discord. Hopefully it's really easy to follow everything, but if you need any help, just let myself or the mods know. But I, I'm so glad that so many of y'all are here today. Ashton, welcome in. Jenny, welcome in. Nathalia, welcome in. What is going on, you guys? Um, okay, I have not checked my Dream Snaps results, so we need to do that. I still need to check Scrooges, and my goal and mission for today is to actually try to finish this bakery and Blade of Trust. Um, yeah, yesterday I thought I could do all of that too, and it turned out that it took me three and a half hours to decorate one room. Uh, it was a struggle bus. Yesterday was a struggle for me, but I'm gonna have a better day today. I already know that. I've already put in the intentions that I'm gonna have a better day today, so that's what we're gonna do. So I appreciate y'all being here. Holly, Amy, hello. Holly, enjoy your lurk. Good luck cleaning your valley. I hope that goes well for you. Teacup, enjoy your lurk. Makeup looks cute. Up. Oh, thank you, Harley. I've been really feeling the blue. It's very Y2K. I'm here for it. That real icy blue. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. I think it's helping me get out of the winter funk too. It's like color, a little bit of colorful makeup. You know what I mean? Um, Deb, welcome in. Spacey, hello. Um, oh my gosh, this is the chair that I've been wanting. <laughs> this chair is so boring probably to so many of you, but I have been on the hunt for this chair simple kitchen chair it's just plain nice all wood chair i need to order more of those honestly if i had that yesterday i probably would have used that in the cafe we would have had a whole nother look in our bakery today <laughs> we would have oh i don't have this hello scrooge how are you today sir Blue looks good on you. Oh, thank you. It's one of my favorite colors. Such a good chair. It's my favorite chair. Okay, you get it then. You get it. This is in my store. Anybody on the hunt for this? Um. Okay, nothing else. You know what? I'm going to order more of those chairs. Get Marlon sleeping. I didn't check my mailbox. I need to go back and do that. Why do I always do that? I always forget to check my Dream Snaps results. Will, welcome in. Who's your favorite villager? Um, Stitch. I think Stitch is still my favorite villager. But I'd love to know from y'all, who is your favorite villager? Gracie Ann, welcome in. Dun, dun, dun. Sabrine, hello. Okay, chairs. 
I'm gonna go all the way to the bottom. Olaf Stitch. I currently have it set so none of my villagers can bother me in my valley. You know what? I feel like I should get I feel like I should just get like an even 20. Stitch and Ariel, yeah. I do love Ariel, like she's probably my favorite Disney character, but I don't know. I feel like I vibe more with Stitch in Disney Dream Live Alley. I want to love Ariel more in the game, but I don't know. She's just like a, a teeny bit, teeny bit boring. She's missing that Ariel personality for me in the game. I also love her as a mermaid and you can't hang out with her as a mermaid. Womp, womp, womp. So, Jack. Jack is another great one. Jack is another great one. So many good ones. Katie, welcome in. Owen, welcome in. So great to see y'all. Okay, what do you have for us? How do we do on the stream, Sam? I don't know. This is for the ancient aesthetic one, right? Six days left on the star path. Is that correct? Ariel needs a little more sparkle. Speaking of Ariel needing a little more sparkle, you just brought the vision of Ariel coming out of the sea and that gorgeous sparkly blue dress. Kind of like my eyeshadow. I'm not going to lie. Can we get that as a dream style? Ariel in her pale, sparkly dress. Imagine her walking on your Dazzle Beach in that. She would probably take top contender for my favorite villager at that point. Belle and Remy. I do really like Belle. This was for the ancient aesthetics. We got 1,200? I mean, that's really good, but is it bad that I was really hoping to receive 4,000 moonstones? I loved this one. I loved this one. Imagine if there was scuba diving in the game and we can hang out with Ariel. That would be amazing if we could swim with Ariel. Um, 15,000. Wait, 1,500 for the last one I was bummed because I loved it. I'm I'm feeling the same way, Ashton. I get it. I'm feeling the same way. <laughs> she would be slaying in that dress. Look, I'll take it. I just really, I loved that one. Did we get the trophy? Oh my God. Did we just get the trophy? My face and reaction, I was not expecting that. Okay. I've not seen this yet in game. Have you guys seen this yet? Have you guys seen anybody with this trophy yet? Oh my God, we gotta flex this. Oh, where are we gonna put this? Oh my gosh, if I didn't have trees every five spaces. Imagine putting it right in front of Walt and Mortimer. Aw, Owen, I hope your day gets better. Something magical welcome in. I was robbed. Need to clip the reaction. Where's Kenzie? Uh-oh, we're about to summon Kenzie to make some edits. <laughs> um... Where do we put it? Where do we display such a magnificent achievement in my valley? Where do we put it? My eye is watering. I think I got too excited. Where do we put it? Got it today too? 
This is a massive achievement. I really feel like it should be right in the front, at least for right now. At least until I figure out a better spot. Can I put it right in front of the bench? Right in the middle, right? Right in the middle, front and center. I need all these villagers to see. Look what we got today. Does it? What is that? <laughs> what is that? Does that say something and I just can't read it on the switch? Okay, it is really obnoxious in front of Walt. It's so shiny. Let me put it in the meadow. Let me move it down into the meadow because the light is just so much better. The reaction was the best. I'm, I'm cringing. I was not, look, once I saw that I was getting something for the achievements, I was like, oh my God, is this a trophy? I've been waiting. Can this be, is this centered? Let me take a look at this gold glowing in the sun. Wow, it's like marble. This thing weighs a ton, guys. I'm not moving it again, it was so heavy. Trophy's a lot bigger. It, it kind of is. I did, I wasn't expecting it to be like a tabletop one. Coral Island lets you turn into a mermaid. I need to play that game. I do need to play that game. Um, unfortunately, it's not on the Switch yet. Okay, here's me flexing with my trophy. I feel like maybe I should put it next to my... Well, you know what? We're getting that new shop. It should probably go there, but... It would be really nice to have it by my little portal. So when somebody comes over, they're like, oh my gosh. Look what Sav has. <laughs> Let me just flex it. An under the sea DLC? <laughs> that would be amazing. I wish I could play Coral Island. It's not out on Switch yet. I read, I literally looked up this morning cause I've, I wanna try it. I looked up like, when is this game coming on Switch? Cause some of y'all let me know that it has plans to and it's supposed to come out this year. But I don't think that there is a date set for it yet. But that would be fantastic. I would love to be able to swim around like a Little Mermaid in game and in real life. <laughs> Just to clarify, both of those. Both of those would be amazing. Under the DLC. Under the DLC. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. That's exactly right, Henry. How are you doing, by the way, Henry? Welcome in. Not y'all about to do the same thing. Lucy, welcome in. What is going on? Katie, I hope you get this trophy soon. Okay, I feel like the lighting is a bit strange right now. Let me go back a little bit. So, if y'all were not here yesterday, um, I planned to do what I am continuing to do today. I thought that I could finish all this yesterday and I didn't. So what I've been working on is decorating the Glade of Trust, but mostly working on the inside of this bakery. Which is still a work in progress. <laughs> But this is what we did yesterday. This is how we left it yesterday. I am happy with this room. You know what I did want to take a look at? The, oh wait, what is this? I can't believe that I finally received this new item in the red chest when I recently got it in Scrooge's, finally. It 
and the white piano, which is another fantastic item that I would have been excited to receive in this package. Are you serious? Okay. 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 New welcome in. I'm doing well. I'm doing well. Congrats on receiving your trophy. Thank you. Can't wait to see where you place it. Where? I feel like it makes sense to have it in the plaza. But I think wherever we get this new building, um, I think it should go outside of that. Because I think it's looking like that building's going to have something to do with dream snaps. Or a touch of magic. I'm not sure. I really haven't looked too much into it. Um, I did want to see if I can change the doors to anything better. But I don't... I mean, that door is, is that door better than the green one? Let's see what this one looks like. Okay, honestly, not terrible. Um, congratulations on your trophies. How, how did you do on your dream snap? I received 1200 moonstones was that right 1200 moonstones okay not that door that door is really expensive like hard to craft uh i'm thinking either the double door or or the monster door The monster door strangely looks better. I'm using that one, I think. I mean, the plane door is fine. This one just kind of blends in a better, a bit better, right? Okay. So this is the inside of the bakery. We haven't, we haven't designed the other three rooms, but I think I need to tackle the outside today. And then if we still have plenty of time, we can continue working inside. But I don't think that decorating this yard should be too, too bad. It's kind of just like filling in with plants and stuff. So let's clean this up. Still waiting for my collect all button to come back. Um, God, I want to end my dream snap. Went to take a picture and started raining. I feel like this is not the week for rain in your dream snap. Okay, if you haven't seen the dream snap yet. This is the new theme, by the way. Moana's Village. Get into an island groove, dress up your village with decor inspired by the world of Moana. So I think I'm gonna do this maybe next time. Cause I don't, I'm not in the island mood yet, okay? I'm still in my bakery mood. Oh, and I'll show the item shop in case anybody's curious. 1200, that snap was amazing. Definitely a 4K one. Sometimes the rankings seem very strange, but you got a shiny trophy. I mean, yeah, I did get the trophy, but I do feel like, can I just toot my own horn and say that I also feel like it should have received 4,000 moonstones? Okay, I'll just say it. I'll just say it. I really liked it. I thought it was cute. It looked like dream snaps that I've seen people receive 4,000 moonstones for before. So I kind of hoped it would do better. Excited about this week's prompt, especially after last week. I think it's a good prompt. Um, everybody should be able to participate, even if you're a new player, I think because you get Maui and Moana very early on in the game. 
so I think it should be good. There's also a lot of items and clothing items you can use for it, so I think it should be a good one. Um, so this is the new item shop. This is the item shop. Now I did not post an item shop review today because there's nothing new. There's nothing new that we haven't seen yet before. Kat, thank you so much for becoming a Teaspoon member. I appreciate that so much. Let's get some hearts and love in the chat for Kat. Chat for Kat. <laughs> thank you guys. Riley's Corner, welcome in. Um, so yeah, no new item shop reviews today, but we have the Purple Cottage, which I love. The Incredo Scrolls in the shop. Which like, why didn't they just put in the shop last week too with the costumes? I don't really, I don't really know. Um, the Pizza Planet, which is kind of cool. Now you cannot decorate the inside of the Pizza Planet. It's an item, not a house. We've got the Pirate set, which is very cool. I do love this set. This map table is great. The Fountain of Youth is really cool. And the grate. I used a, I used this grate quite a bit. Um, decorating the Prince Eric's ship. So that's a good one. And then we have Mike and Sully's apartment. The gift bag bundle, which I don't... I just don't care about it. <laughs> I just don't care about it. So I'm going to pass on that. We've got the Summer Vacation Scrooge. don't really care if I have this right now either. And then the Art Deco TV and stand, which I feel like people have been wanting this to come back. Or at least just the Art Deco furniture in general. So that's, that's the tea. That's what's in the store. If, if you guys don't have the Incredi Squirrel, how much was it? How much is the Incredi Squirrel showing up as? Did somebody... Oh, Henry, let me know. 2000 for the squirrel? That's like 10 bucks, isn't it? That's almost like 10 bucks. And how much would it be if you... How much is it for the star path? don't remember that does seem like a lot right I mean with the character the character skins are 2500 don't know if I want this girl that's the same as every other pet I guess it I guess it is Premium star path is 3K. See, when it when you do that math. Yeah, does it just, maybe it just seems too expensive because I know it's a star path item and the star path costs 3,000. Whereas just the squirrel costs 2,000 now. I don't know. You guys will have to let me know what I think, what y'all think about that. Um, don't know if I want the squirrel. For one companion, it does seem a bit steep. Because, like, there's also those bundles of companions. How much do those run for? I can't recall. I don't know. I don't know. You guys will have to let me know. Does that seem outrageous or reasonable? I'm sure everybody will have different opinions. I guess it depends on how much you like the Incredibles. If they combined the outfit and the scroll for 3K, I felt like that would have been a better deal. Yeah, why didn't they combine those? It's interesting. Why not? I've heard the Fountain of Youth in the Pirate Bundle is cool. I'll need to find a video of it before. Oh, I can show you how it looks. Um, I've definitely shown it in an item shop before. I'll also show you the Pizza Planet too. 
The purple cottage, I would say, is the thing to get if you don't have it. Um, my fountain of youth is up here. Let me show you it. Whoa! Oh my gosh, it's a mess. <laughs> uh, it's a mess. Hang on, please hold. Okay, no, that's that's a basket of bread. All right, let me get back here. So here is the Fallen of Youth. Maybe this is not the best representation of it in the dark, but here's where I have mine. It has that little fountain at the top, which I love. It does make a little water sound effect. And there's like little skeleton bones and stuff on the side of it. It's really cool. Love the metal grates from the pirate pack. Yeah, that, those are fantastic. Really, really good. The packs of companions are also three, or also 2,000, hmm. <laughs> Zara, welcome in. Mrs. Flower, welcome in. Hello, lovely Sav. Your hair looks so pretty. And oh, thank you so much. Y'all are really hyping me up with this hair today and yesterday. I appreciate that. Brianna, enjoy your lurk. Um, let me show you the pizza planet as well. Yep, yep, the, the lurk command is working. <laughs> There's also now an unlurk command. So when you come out of lurk, you can use that one. If you so desire. Um, here's the pizza planet. My, uh... My beach is looking a little crowded here to show you this. But yeah, the pizza planet is really cool. It lights up. It has a little bench on the corner, although you cannot sit on it. And I think it actually looks really good at night. Let me show you at night. I think the pizza planet looks better at night. Like look at all the lights on it, on the logo. It's just cool, okay? It's just cool. Um, I moved Scar to Attorney Isle. He's currently living in the Glittering Dunes. And I've yet to decorate his yard, but I do have plans for him. Okay. Enough of that. Have you decorated with the sushi... Sushi, sushi chef. Um, no, I have not. I have not, aside from just putting this guy here on my beach. <laughs> um, I want to make like a sushi restaurant inside, but I don't know what. I feel like none of the house skins are exactly the right look that I want I mean I guess I could use the beach house and make it like a beach seafood restaurant I kind of want to I don't know I'm hoping that there's going to be a, a house skin that it's going to work really nice nicely with as a sushi restaurant Okay, let's get down to business here. Um, I was thinking about some kind of balloons outside of the bakery. Kind of like, hey, we're, we're having a grand opening. Check us out. How long have I been playing? I've been playing since week one. 
week one of the game. Lana, thank you so much for the four months. I appreciate you so much. Let's get some hearts and hype in the chat for Lana, seriously. Can't say enough great things about Lana. <laughs> thank you so much for everything that you do. Let's get some mod love in the chat. Thank you so much for being a member for four months and an incredible mod and member of our community. I appreciate that so, so much. Um, Gothel needs to go. Gothel needs to go. You know what? Part of the reason why I put this bakery here is to torment Mother Gothel. That she has to walk past this bakery every day and be tempted because she's so vain. <laughs> She probably would not want to set foot in this bakery, but I'm going to tempt her. We're going to tempt her. Like, mm, there's these balloons. Super, super cute. Um, what about the balloons? What about... I'm not seeing them. Maybe I have to order them? I don't see it. Um, the balloons I was thinking of. I know I use them here. Let me see how these might look. I think I might have to order them from Scrooge if we want to use them. These are like pink and purple. I actually do like this one. It's got the red on it. I really want to cover that mailbox. I really want to cover that mailbox. Something like that. All you need is hemp gothel as an advertisement saying the food will make her younger. Imagine. That's like a mean girl's thing to do. Put another bundle here by the stall. Okay. And then maybe one behind this little um, sign. I almost called it a stand. That's not right. The mailboxes really do need to match the house skins. Uh, I guess this is the closest we can get here. Cute and fun. What else would we have in front of our bakery? Um, what's some other cute stuff we would see? Although me, I'm like, oh, let's put some barrels and crates. But I feel like that's all I've been doing. Yeah. Like a tea, a tea cart maybe? Or is it too fancy? I feel like I use the tea card a lot for obvious reasons, but what else should we, what else should we add? Um, I do have a little sitting area right here. Lana, thank you so much for gifting a membership. You didn't have to do that. Zara, enjoy your membership. Be sure to give a little thank you to Lana. Thank you so much. Zara, welcome to the tea party. Oh, the pink potted hydrangeas. Those would be super cute. The mailbox is still not my favorite. <laughs> it's 
still not my favorite. Yes, let's look at let's look at the the foliage. I'm wondering. Yes, this looks very cute out here. I think I should remove these because they're not covering the mailbox enough. I'll be honest. They're not doing what I need them to do. But what could? There's that trusty crate. <laughs> hmm. Let's just let's just take a look. Okay, let's just take a look at the crate. Cause then I could maybe put the hydrangeas on top of it. you can put the um excuse me wait can I put why not the balloons the crate you can put into the mailbox Okay, this is a discovery. Please let me put this on top. Okay, we're done. <laughs> okay, that is adorable and absolutely perfect. Look, there's nothing weird to see here. Everything is normal. Okay, um, now that I know I can do that with the bakery, that's amazing. I don't think I can do that with this one though. It's like a special... Look, my luck, that's something that they're gonna patch. <laughs> that's something that they're gonna change. I am happy. I look so happy because I am happy. I can't stand seeing the mailboxes on the houses. I think they're hideous. Mailbox hat. Okay, I think it only works on this one though. Just so y'all know. Don't, don't get too excited. I think it's only gonna work on the bakery. See, this one you can't put stuff on top of the mailbox. The house looks, the house looks depressed. Yeah, this is, oh my gosh, the moon in the background. Now, how cool is that? Thank you, thank you for the hydration reminder. It should be then if it's not your main house, there shouldn't be a mailbox. I agree. It's kind of nice to be able to check your mailbox anytime you want, but like any other place in the valley, but how often do we really need to do it? We're not like receiving letters from our friends or villagers. Tips and tricks. Look, y'all heard it here first. Y'all saw the discovery here first in live time. Should we do another? Look, I like having things in threes. So three piles of balloons feels right. Now I do like the idea of having another little seating area on this patio. I just think that sounds lovely. So let's grab two more of these pink chairs. I'm thinking maybe over here by this little pond if there's enough room. Um, I'm kind of 
thinking right in this area. Too bad we can't craft a cute mailbox. We can craft mailboxes, but I, I do agree that they are not very cute. It's just a silver or gray and a red one. So I'm not really, not really impressed with that. Where is this table? I feel like I have to have gone past it. Unless I'm, unless I'm out, oh here it is. Yes, please be sure to hit the like button guys if you have not already. Please and thank you. Okay, let me move these in a bit. Feeling like we might need some more hydrangea bundles. Hydrangeas are lovely. Honestly, they're probably one of my favorite flowers. So let's put another one over here, because you know I like things and in threes, so we got three balloon bundles, three hydrangea bundles. It's just kind of how things work around here. Okay. Let's get to covering up some of this path a bit. They're so pretty and they smell divine. Maybe a shrub, maybe a shrub here. Uh, let's see. It's kind of clipping into the chair. Do we care? Maybe I can kind of stagger it. I do play on Switch, by the way, so. Hello. If this is your first time watching somebody play this game with a controller, bear with me. <laughs> bear with me. All right, let's put that there. Maybe a little... Love the smell. Love the smell of the color purple. <laughs> okay. Purple definitely does have a smell. Definitely has a distinct scent, doesn't it? I would maybe swap Goofy stall out for an ice cream cart. Should it could be like a bakery and an ice cream parlor? That would be a cute idea. Um, the only thing is I don't know where else I should incorporate Goofy stall if it's not hidden next to this bakery. So that was kind of my reasoning for doing that. Okay, let me check. What rocks am I using? Okay. The Forgotten Lands. Wish I started this game on my Switch? Why? Why do you wish that you started it on Switch? I feel like certain colors do have smells. Colors have smells? Okay. Like what? Like what does blue smell like? I 
Okay. We're getting somewhere. Things are happening. Okay, what else did I put over here? Butterfly flowers, logs, clusters of rocks. Guys, I feel like it went from being freezing cold to unbearably hot in a matter of two days for me. And I, I currently feel like I'm melting sitting here with my lights on. <laughs> what is going on? Just jump. Okay. Wait. When I look at the color blue, it smells fresh and clean. I get it, because that's exactly what I was picturing. Like, airy, laundry, crisp ocean air. That's the color blue. That's what it smells like. I get it. When I travel and take my switch, I can't play. Oh. Oh, I got you, I got you, I got you. <laughs> I only did the first room in the bakery so far. I've only done the front room. I have not gotten to decorating the rest of it yet. I was hoping we could do that today. Or at least some of it. Okay, do we feel like we want another tree around here? I also should save. And don't wish for the snow back. Look, I'm not going that extreme. What a cute little area to sit in front of the Haunted Mansion. You're never alone when you're dining at the Haunted Mansion. Smells like the forest. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, let me see a little, maybe another tree by this little sitting area. Or we also can use the kind of dead looking trees. so much for 50 likes thank you thank you oh my gosh ariana thank you so much for the five dollar super or i'm sorry the ten dollar super chat thank you so much oh it's your fifth super oh my gosh it's your fifth super chat <laughs> that's where i got the five from thank you so much Happy to pop in and see you and everyone. Oh my gosh, have such a wonderful Wednesday, Ariana. Thank you so much. That was so generous of you. Let's get some hearts in the chat. Y'all are already doing it. Look, I don't even really have to say it anymore. Y'all just get the confetti and the hearts flying. That's what I love to see. Thank you. Um, I appreciate that. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Should this, I'm thinking maybe this little guy over here. Out in the swamp the swamp um yes the pink chairs are from scrooge if he so chooses to bless your shop with something that you don't already have okay i think this tree might be a little bit too big although it's kind of nice right there right there 
Um, might want another one on this side to fill up space back here. So there's nothing really happening back there. So let's pop this one in the back. Don't like to melt in the summer. Look, that's why I carry around a mini fan. Last year, look, I'll show you. I got one of these rechargeable fans. <laughs> and I am a little old woman that walks around in the summer absolutely everywhere and brings this. I can't be caught without it now. Mara, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for blessing us today. How are you doing? Thank you for joining us. What is going on? How are you? Um, this is the highlight of my day when I get to visit my family. Oh my gosh, that's so lovely of you to say. Thank you. Yuri, welcome in. Love the fan. Of course it's pink. Of course it's pink. <laughs> Of course it's pink. It's actually like a life saver. Seriously? Just got a fan attached to a spray bottle. You can mist yourself with cool water at the same, wow. Living in luxury. Living in luxury. Love to hear it. Wait, this is not the right plant. Happy dream snap day. I'm avoiding doing my dream snap, but happy dream snap day to you. Welcome in, David. Oh, Miss Queen, welcome in. What is going on, you guys? How's everybody's update day? How did y'all all score on your dream snap? How do we feel about the new dream snap? My mom has one of those too. She brings it everywhere. I also kind of want one myself. See, I had one first and then my mom was like, hey, little fan you have you think you can get me one of those <laughs> and I was like yeah <laughs> yeah of course I can now I think I might just be getting everyone one this year everybody should get a portable fan it's a game changer especially as someone who rides public transportation in the summer I don't know if any of y'all do as well, but if you've ever ridden public transportation in the summer, you might know how valuable it is to have <laughs> the cooling ability of a fan, but also the, the ability to blow fresher air on your face is really nice on public transportation in the summer because I swear people be ta forgetting to take a shower in the summer. Okay? They be forgetting to take a shower in the summer. And if you know, you know, but the stench is not great. <laughs> so the fan really comes in handy, okay? It really, really does. Results aren't in yet either? Why is that? Why do people get the results at different times? I, I don't even know why that would be the case. That's so strange. That is so strange. Um, I'm on the east coast of the US. I got 4,000, I'm so glad because I think my hero shot is going to stay. Don't say that, you never know. Oh, we didn't vote. I would like to vote on the dream snaps because um, I kind of want to see what everybody did. How did everybody do for that one? I'm, I'm curious to see if more people did incredible stuff or if they went with like a generic kind of superhero. 
Um, raspberry bushes. Oh, I wanted to put the raspberry bushes around the bakery. Isn't that cute? Could put one. Oh, there's a dig spot right there. That's kind of cute, tucked in there, isn't it? I like it. Always have to log out and then it shows up on my, my mail. If I log in after, if I log in after 9 a.m. on Wednesday, my results are always there, I think. They're usually always there. I took the subway for five years for school and I smelt things no human should ever experience. Yes. You witness and smell things that you never thought would be possible. I get it. Nicely done. 2,500 moonstones is great. I just don't know why all the results take so long to come out for everyone, right? Like, what is the holdup? All the voting is done. Shouldn't y'all have the results? That's just what I think. Okay, let's put this little one here. Let's grab uh, maybe this one here. I need a stone. I need some stones. Look well, like I'm, I'm in an area where there's not a lot of public transportation. I can't imagine walking around in heat waiting for a cab or this. That's another thing too, even just like waiting. <laughs> it's hot, but public transportation is kind of awesome. I mean, there's definitely downsides, but quite a lot of positive. Julia, hello, 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 welcome in. stones here if I can because I feel like sometimes I can't pick the bushes if there's too many plants by them. I hope your results are there when you log in. I hope they're there. Um, have no class today so I can stay for the whole stream. Thank you for gracing us with your presence and being here. All right, let's put, uh, you know what? Let's get one of those little pink ones. Where are they? The petal bush. I love this one a lot now. It's just so cute. Put that there. Okay, let me see. What else did we put over here? I need to mix in some of these red trees on the other side. I haven't really done that. It's been a lot of the ancient, I mean, honestly, it's been like exclusively the <laughs> Beats relying on a car to get everywhere. Premium shop is pretty mad. Yeah, there's nothing new. There's nothing new this today, so. That was fine though. 
you know what, I was very productive with my time that I would have spent using to make my item shop review. <laughs> I was very productive. I got, I went into like a little bit of a spring cleaning, spring cleaning mode. And got a bunch of laundry and stuff like that put away. So it was good. There's another dig, is there a dig spot there? Wait, I thought I just saw it and then it disappeared. I guess not. It's feeling good, it's feeling good over here. I think we've seen it all for the Monsters Inc update. Why does it kind of feel that way? feeling that way, I guess. Oh my gosh, so many of y'all are finishing the star path. Way to go, Riley, nicely done. Neil, nicely done. Next update should be in two to three weeks. Guys, I need to know when the update is coming. I need the date announced not just the day before. Levi, welcome in. Loving the swamp vibe. It is very, it's a very pretty swamp. It's a very pretty swamp. April 24th, the, that's so soon. That's. That's in two weeks. Pink chairs are cute. I finally got them last week. April 24th. Is that a Wednesday? Thinking the same couple of weeks for the next update. Star Path ends soon, and they usually give us a week after the following. Look, we've plowed ourselves before, though. I'm so hesitant to believe when we all think things are happening. I'm like, mm, I'll just wait. I'll just wait for them to say something. <laughs> I'm tired of acting a fool. I'm tired of it. Lorette, welcome in. How are you today? Hope you're doing well. Thank you for joining us. We're just doing some, some cozy decorating and chit-chatting. I'll eventually get back into working on my bakery. Right now, I just need foliage. 24th is a Wednesday. Okay, well, if it's a Wednesday, I'll be here. I'll be here. I'll be here. I'll be streaming. Five more tasks. You've got this. You've got you've got the star path. You can totally do it. As long as there's enough time to like, if you have the gifting ones. If y'all have not been on your A game for the gifting, y'all need to do that for your star path. Stop ignoring your villagers. Get out the gifts. Give the people what they want. <laughs> Even Mama G. Regardless of if she deserves your gifts. Getting ready to put on my clown makeup. Don't forget the big red nose, okay? It's key. It's critical to the look. You gotta have it. Don't forget. Okay. 
gonna finally work on my storage room instead of throwing it on the floor. <laughs> um, I aspire to be you. I aspire to be you, Riley, because I really need to go through my storage situation again. I need to combine some things. I need to simplify things. Yeah, that's gonna happen. Prince Eric too? There's not a... Was there a... Was there a quest to give him stuff? I don't think he was even included. I don't think he was even mentioned or included in the star path, but if Flute Boy is on your star path, feel free to just not do that one. You know what, just buy the tokens instead. <laughs> Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, I was gonna ask that as well, Naomi. What is every, what are we predicting for the next star path, by the way? Let's think about it. Let's think about it. Where is the road, where is the current roadmap, by the way? Also, when is the DLC update? Okay, I will save my game, thank you, true. True, 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 true. Throwing it on the floor would I See, I, I'm not quite so bad that <laughs> he just wanted to troll me. Well, thank you for trolling me. <laughs> so, okay, I don't usually throw things on the floor in my game. Except in Animal Crossing, I drop everything all over my island, but I definitely make a, ch like just put a chest down and put tons of random stuff in it and I didn't quite realize how frustrating it was um until I was playing Lego Fortnite with my partner and some of our friends and they were they were very into being very organized with the chests and I just couldn't be bothered I just throw everything into a chest and I'm like here it's fine Deal with it later. But then you never deal with it later. That's that's my tendency. I've noticed Eric stalking me much more since I started watching your channel, just saying. Um, by any chance are you watching while playing? Because I think that your Eric is learning from my Eric. And maybe that's how that's happening. I don't know. Eternity Isle is mid-spring. A large chest for every single item in the game. See, I don't want to even waste my time running around to every individual chest doing that. I, I want to be like that and be ultra organized, but I also don't want the time for that. If we could just drop everything in our home. Okay, wait, wait, how cool would this be? You could drop stuff in your home chest. And it would auto sort it into the chest that has the same item anywhere in your valley or attorney aisle. That... That would be a really huge update. He's being influ Eric was being influenced. He's being influenced. The DLC is late spring. I think that Disney Dreamlight Valley has different. I think that they have different definitions for early and late spring, and I think that they just change those definitions whenever they so please, personally. That's what I think. All right, let's have a cheesecake. Okay, that turtle better not eat that. Let's have macaroons and some cheesecake.
divine. Absolutely divine. What style of organization would be the best part of Look, put me in charge of the update content, okay? I've got ideas. I put a lot of time into this game. I know some stuff. I know some problems that I would love to sort out. Number one thing I would do is put a search bar in. Let me search for the item. Nobody has time to sort through their entire catalog. Every single time they're looking for something that they know exactly what they want. You know how many times I have wait, like how much time I have wasted scrolling through items and just passing the ones I'm looking for just because it's just inefficient. Okay. Um, let me finish up around this little bit of the pond. Okay, that's not too much. That's not too much. we can look at the old server. Okay. Now, I'm uh, imagining it's going to be a summer star path. Right? Can we perhaps maybe agree that it will most likely be a summer themed star path? But then it always has something else mixed into the theme. And that usually has to go with whatever the update theme is. Which is what now? What is coming in the next update? Daisy? Tiana? Who's coming first? I, are we getting multiple characters? I don't, I can't even keep up. Wanted to tell you I found my scar lore in my catalog furniture tab it was towards the very bottom I think I checked every possible thing I could with the scar lore I think I've I think it's just gone forever Daisy's next is it just Daisy Tiana's so Tiana's in the summer okay so Daisy's coming floral summer star path Floral summer. I mean, I don't really want floral summer. Floral is spring. If they gave us floral summer, I would be like, come on, you guys were late again. <laughs> late summer for Tiana. Okay, so Tiana will probably be mixed in with the fall star path theme. Search bar for cooking, true. Next is Daisy and then Mulan. Wait, how many updates are we getting this summer? I gotta pull, I gotta pull up the um, roadmap again and take a, take a gander at that. A search bar for everything. Want to decorate but keeping space available for more characters. So that's kind of what I'm going to do in this biome is I'm only going to decorate these sections where I have path. I'm not going to decorate any of this L section of the glade. Because I'd like to keep it open for other characters right now. And also my item limit is... I just took a look at it and I'm upset. I can't talk about it. I can't talk about it. I'm upset. How am I going to finish my valley? I don't know how I ever fully decorated. I mean, I guess I just wasn't decorating the same way I'm decorating now. 
how am I ever going to decorate the entirety of my valley with 3,000 items again? Okay, so wait, wait, Riley, I think you are right. We're getting the the lucky villager with the DLC update is the same time as the daisy one, right? And the star pack, that's gonna be a lot. With the new star pack too? It's gonna be a lot going on. Sixty likes. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Um put a shrub here. Valley has never truly been fully decorated. It's so nice to run around in a fully decorated valley for a little bit though. And then I'm like, uh, Okay, time to do something new. Time to put some more stuff out. I don't want Oswald or Figment. Am I awful? Are Stanley Cups worth it? As somebody who does not have one, I'm going to say no. I'm going to say it's not worth it. I think it's overhyped. There's always going to be a new fad that somebody's, that it's going to be hyped up like the Stanley. Like it's just going to be replaced with something else. That's my opinion. <laughs> That's my opinion. Also, I just don't get the thing with the Stanleys because like people are obsessed with collecting them and it's like, isn't the point of having a water bottle to have like, not a, not a bajillion of them? Doesn't that kind of defeat the purpose, but. They leak a lot. T, let's talk about it. I'll keep using my Hydro Flask. See, remember when it used to be the Hydro Flask? That it was all anybody wanted? Also the fighting over it, I, I just don't get it. They also look so heavy. Like, this is like, I wanna say this is like a 50 ounce container. This thing gets heavy. But I don't, carry this around with me out of my house. Like this is, this goes from my desk to my couch. Expose straw. Don't they have lead in them? Don't get the hype, it's just a bottle. That's how I feel. I don't really care. It is a jug. It is It is a jug. It is also probably a weapon. <laughs> Those water bottles are heavy. I just don't know how people carry them around. I just don't get it. Should I put it? I mean, that one might be too much. Tiny little dead trees. What other trees did I use? trees. Not that one. This one. I don't want to block a bunch of the bakery though. So maybe I don't want that. 
Okay, true. Y'all also gotta wash the your water bottles. Are y'all washing your reusable water bottles? Seriously, let's... <laughs> Seriously? Let's talk about it for a moment. Because I have a cup that I have been using a lot. And I just noticed yesterday that there was mold growing in the top of the lid. Like I was cleaning all the rest of it, but not cleaning the bottom of the lid too well, I guess. Um, so yeah, definitely inspect those water bottles because I feel like they don't get cleaned as often as they should. And that's definitely not, not ideal. Definitely not ideal. They still need to be washed even if it's just, if it's just water. They do. Put some soap in there. Look, I washed mine too, but it wasn't good enough. BRB going to wash my cup. Look, a lot of them you can't put in the dishwasher. Wash them daily. Oh, the rubber, the rubber lining around the lid. Yes, you have to like peel that off and clean under it because that gets grody. so grody can this please fit no okay that's fine too that's fine too I guess A lot of them you can put them in the dishwasher. Okay. Um, I've heard people never wash theirs. Those are the people that have 40 Stanleys and they just don't need to wash it because they have 39 other cups. So they just grab a new one. It's a single use reusable cup. That is so bad. I can't. That is so bad. Okay, I'm not loving this. Oh, yeah, you gotta clean those kettles, too. For sure. I had one of those that was getting a little moldy, too. Okay, um, I feel like this little dump is getting a little lost. Maybe it would be better in this mud area. Um, I wish that this was a seat because I think it would be really cute to see Olaf sitting. Oh my God, imagine Winnie the Pooh. Imagine we have Winnie the Pooh as a villager and he can come over here and sit on the stump. Piglet? my heart. I wouldn't even be able to decorate anymore or like play. I would just be snapping pictures of my villagers the whole time. Coffee machines. I don't even have, I don't have a coffee machine. But yeah, y'all should clean yours. <laughs> Me just adding to all your uh, spring cleaning lists. Winnie could give us honey. Aww. That would be cute. We could start a little apiary. Little valley apiary. That would be cute. 
Thank you for coming to my bottle TED Talk. Remember to join the newsletter for when we come back to your city next year. Okay, I think I'm going to put a little sneaky little cut through path here. Because I know I'm not walking around this the entire time. <laughs> I know I'm taking a shortcut. Winnie the Pooh would be so cute. He would be so cute. <laughs> little bee. Oh, little bee items. Oh, that would be so cute. Imagine if Winnie the Pooh had like a special. You know how like Belle will like pull out a book and read it? What if Winnie the Pooh had like a cute little animation where like one of the butterflies that flies around like lands on his nose? Too cute. Stop it. That would be too cute. I'm telling you, I wouldn't be able to get anything done. I would just be photographing the villagers at all times. Except, all except a certain particular villager. He who shall not be named. Okay, the spacing here not ideal. I'm going to do that. I'm going to try that. Okay, cute little shortcut kind of thing. Um, he gets picked up by a balloon. Imagine little Pooh Bear just floating away with it. Okay, what if he just pulled out a balloon and just walked around with it? Honestly, they should have given that it up to us in Animal Crossing. Like, you know how the villagers will, like, if you play Animal Crossing, they'll pull out, like, a coffee and walk around with it or a little bag? We have balloons in Animal Crossing. Why can't they pull out a balloon and just carry that around? Disney Dreamlight Valley, are you listening? Are you listening with your little notepad? So many characters. Think, think, think. Oh, brother. Oh, brother. A poo onesie in the game. I want a hundred acre wood realm. That would be pretty special. Would be really, really special. Yeah, I was gonna say, does he say bother or brother? He does say oh bother, right? It is bother, right? Yes, him just like digging in a little jar of honey. In t okay, imagine Tigger. I feel like Tigger and Goofy would become really good friends. Just like high energy, just like. What'd you do today? I did this. Da -da -da -da. Oh my gosh, me too. Da -da -da. That would be every conversation with Tigger and Goofy, just like. Stop rambling chit chat. Um, oh bother. Oh bother. That's what I thought. Are you the pink lady on Animal Crossing? What do you mean? Who's the pink lady? Isabel?
Miss Isabel? Winnie's introduction quest should be us helping him get unstuck from a window. It should be us helping him get the last bit of honey out of the jar. His little paw gets stuck in the jar. And we're like, Winnie, let me introduce you to a fine instrument we in the valley like to call a spoon. You're gonna take this tool, put it in the jar, and then just scoop the honey right out. It'll save you a lot of trouble. Let's say it's no bothers given. Oh, that's so cute. That's the perfect shirt to wear to Disney. No bothers given. Okay. Path has stuff all over it. That's great. The Skull Rock Winnie the Pooh? What is that? The Skull Rock Winnie the Pooh? What is that? He's been stuck in the window since the forgetting. so bad. I feel like this is going to look nice at night. The heffalumps. Um, do they have Winnie the Pooh stuff at Disney? Like at the parks? It was in the 1970. Wait. 19, no, 1997. <laughs> Winnie the Pooh movie. And it had a reference to Skull Rock? What do you mean? Okay, I think I need more... I don't know, I'm using these red... These red lights. To make this a bit darker. I think this is like 2 a.m. Why does it look so bright? Why does the light look so strange? It's like so bright on my beach. Okay, maybe I need to go. What? <laughs> Where am I? Okay, this is good. They have a Winnie the Pooh ride. It's one of my favorites. He's a sweet shop. Oh, that's cute. <clears throat> a skull cave with icicles in it. No, I watched Winnie the Pooh growing up, but that's not ringing a bell for me right now. The sunrise. Yeah, it was the sunrise on the beach. Um, so maybe I'll put a street light maybe to the left of the bakery behind that sign. Let's see how that I fit it. Ooh, I don't know if I can put it. Oh, I can't put it this close. Hmm. Well, interesting. You can put stuff into the mailbox <laughs> but you can't put stuff next to the house right there okay um 
further back. I kind of just want a little glow back there. Oh my gosh, I just looked at my item limit again. I can't. I don't know what I'm gonna do. It's not looking good, friends. As I continue to make my issue worse, but this is what we're here for. as much of the beach as I am. I'm not feeling it. I want it to be a bit more secluded over here. Yeah. Might have to relook at some other biomes and no, we can't do I need everything. I need it all. Musical, where? What is that song from? I want it all. I swear that's a song. It's feeling like it's a Sharpay song, but maybe it's not. Maybe I'm thinking of Fabulous. The light looked good. Oh, it did? Okay, I didn't even check it. I didn't even check again. It is? High okay, it is High School Musical with Sharpay. I want it all. Fabulous fashion. Fabulous something. <laughs> I can't remember. Is it a, a, a Queen song? You mean Queen Sharpay? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, probably? So the item count is this up here on the top right. So I play on Switch so I can have a max of 3,000 items. In, in my valley, I currently have 2,914 placed. So I cannot exceed having 3,000 items in my valley. That's what I'm talking about. And then the top number, the 500 out of 600, that's how many... That's how many unique items you can place. So I've used 500 unique items out of 600, which is getting up there too. Now that I've now that I look at it. Womp womp womp. What do we want to do in front of the haunted? Like I don't really want to do too much decorating. I'm feeling like the haunted mansion is abandoned. I'm feeling like it's a little abandoned here. I actually don't think anything is decorated inside of it. I don't know. We have to look inside of here, actually. I know I decorated the nightmare version, but I don't know that I ever decorated this one. I don't think I did. I think she sings it in line in the song, but it's not. Th I think it's fabulous. Fabulous fashion, fabulous style. I think that's it. Not that one. I need the pe 
petal flush. Petals, I guess it's at the bottom. Gravestones and swamp trees. Probably my favorite song. I mean, not ever. Not of any, not out of everything, but. <laughs> In high school, you so cool. <laughs> Although, that's the, that's High School Musical 2, I think. You know what? I also wasn't the biggest fan of. I wasn't the biggest fan of High School Musical when it came out either. I remember it was very hyped up. Like, it was very beloved when it came out by a lot of people my age. And I was just like, hmm. Like, it's cool. I like it. But I wasn't all, all that into it as much as I feel like other people were. Out with the old, in with the new. Goodbye, clouds of gray. Hello, skies of blue. A dip in the pool, a trip to the spa. <laughs> the way I still remember it. I'll never be over Zach Afron's bet on it dance sequence, though. That was iconic. That's still such a meme. Never seen the movies? I was not a, okay, okay. Harley, I think I was the same. I don't know, like the other girls face. Yes, I think that that was me. Everybody was like, oh my gosh, Zac Efron in that movie, da da da. And I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna play, um, I don't even know how old I was. I was probably playing web webkins or something at the time. <laughs> like, yeah, I don't really care. It's cool and all, but whatever. Um, the fact that I want to put more crates in front of this mailbox, I mean. Okay, what else can I put? Endless days in my shades, the whole world according to moi. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> the drama. The drama and the chewed in that song. I love it. Um, doing the star path feels like a chore to me. Do you have any tips on dealing with that? If it's feeling too much like a chore, it sounds like you're not having fun. So... If it's feeling like a chore, don't, I mean, don't do it then. Don't do it then. Never saw the third one? Uh, I don't think I did either. There's a, there's a third one? I don't know if I ever saw it. <laughs> rip to all my un, rip to all my unfed Neopets. don't really remember playing Neopets on the computer. I, I know I had one. I want to say it looked like Eevee. I want to say it looked like Eevee the Pokemon. Um, but I was definitely into Webkins. I was probably as into Webkins at the time of that whole situation. Um, as I am now into Disney Life Valley. And Webkins, if you don't know, I don't even know if they still exist. I really wish that I could get on my old account and see all of my animals and everything that I named them and all the stuff I had done. I think that that would just be really funny to see. 
what past little gamer sav had created um but webkins were like stuffed animals that you would get a code for and then you could sign into webkins on the computer and have the stuffed animal um as a virtual pet too and you could like play games with them and make a house for them and you can have multiple webkins living together i had so many of those little things and who was that guy that we would go to he was like a dog it was like an npc that was like a miner and you would do something with like gems or something we would go like my i don't know did we go mining in webkin i have no idea it's such a blur it's honestly such a fever dream still have my webkin stuffy i don't think i have any more of them I do wish that I could get on my account, but I think they, at one point they made it so like you had to keep buying st more webkins to like keep your account active. And I was like, I've got so many. I can't keep buying these. I was going to the, to the Hallmark store at the mall just to buy webkins. Art, oh, that's right, art fact. Artifact. You mind, we did mine for gems, didn't we? But he was like kind of a scammer, right? He was kind of a, a, a sleazy guy, if I remember. Wouldn't he try to like hoodwink us and stuff? He was like Tom Nook-esque. Before I even knew who Tom Nook was. At least that's how I remember him being in my mind. Maybe he wasn't like that. I feel like he would over he would always offer me something and I was like, seriously? That's it. Dream Webkin is the rainbow armadillo. I don't remember there ever being armadillos when I played. The first one I had was a cheetah. First one I had was a cheetah. I got it for my birthday. Um, that introduced me to the world of Webkins, and then that was all I wanted to do. He was an honest guy. Okay, I just completely made up that whole identity for him then. For some reason, I feel like I remember not liking him. I don't remember why. He didn't lowball you or something? <laughs> the prices, I swear he did something like that. <laughs> Maybe I just found him irritating for some reason. So lost, I have no idea. Look up a webkin, look up webkins. They are really cute. <laughs> they are really cute. I don't remember seeing armadillos when I played. Never heard of a dream. Well, I think they just mean like the one that you would want the most, like the ultimate dreamy. Like sometimes in Animal Crossing we'll say like that's a dreamy villager is like your ultimate like, oh my gosh, I would do anything to have that one. I think I'm just gonna do something like that in front of the, I'm not doing too much in front of the Haunted Mansion. I just don't want to. I think it's pretty as is. Also my item limit can't take it. Okay. Let me take a peek in here. Welcome to the curio shop. Hope you find what you were looking for. You know what? Honestly, just the same dialogue he would say is probably what would annoy me. That probably is what annoyed me. Okay, there's nothing in here. You ranked 401 on your dreams. Yours was really good. 
Yours was really good. Nicely done. Wow. The under 1000 club? Let's go. Okay, did I just finish doing all this? Wait, did I finish it? Wait, wait, wait. Surely I left some empty space somewhere, right? No, I got it all, didn't I? I think the haunted mansion looks pretty over here. It's... This area kind of turned out nicer than I planned. Like, it's giving... B&B, &B, like, a, like a bed and breakfast and a bakery vibe over here. I like it. I want to hang out and have some beignets. Have not heard of Neopets? <gasps> Tamagotchi. I was definitely a Tamagotchi girly. I want to play the new Tamagotchi game. I've, I've been thinking it and saying it for a while. Um, I kind of wanted to like try it out like and record a video and be like, I used to play all the Tamagotchi games and there's a new one um, in the Apple store. I wanna try it. I, wanna, I, I don't really remember what I used to even do in those games. Cause there were Switch games as well as like the actual little Tamagotchi friends, which I still have. I think I kept two of my Tamagotchis. Yes, it's a, it's an app. No, 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 not the, not the app that's like having a Tamagotchi. It's like the games. So there were Nintendo, not Nintendo Switch, but DS games for Tamagotchis. It's different. I forget what, what I would even do in them. Um, I have been to New Orleans. <gasps> Tamagotchi. Oh my gosh. Do yourself, do yourself a favor and just order one. Just buy a Tamagotchi. I've seen them at Target. Right? I need to, I need to check that game out. It's on the Apple, it's on the Apple Arcade. So you have to have that subscription, which I haven't done all that, but... I love Disney Dream Life Valley, don't get me wrong, but lately I've been feeling like it's missing something in the decorating realm for me. Um, it's just not, I feel like I have ideas and things I wanna do, but I just can't always make them come to life because some of the decorating can be quite limiting. So I've kind of been wanting to play, like try a new game. And I think I might try the Tamagotchi game. I don't even know if you can decorate it. I don't even know. Tamagotchi Uni? Okay, I kind of like these, but maybe not there, they're kind of blend, they're kind of blending in. It c maybe it could be cute on the sides of the door, or I don't know, I just had the idea of maybe wanting to use these curtains. Yeah, there's parts of Disney Dreamlight Valley decorating that's just become quite frustrating. Like, why are these things not being fixed? I really wish I could play Sims. Because I could just sit and decorate in The Sims forever, I think. I don't know, how do we feel about the current thing? I think it would be better on the brick. If I could put this over the window, that would be a game changer. But they said no. They said 
and no curtains on the windows. That's crazy. That's craziness to put a curtain on your window. They're cute. I've not played them or have had any stuffed animals of them. Wait, there's Tamagotchi stuffed animals. Am I about to get back into my Tamagotchi things? Yeah, why can't I put the curtains on the windows? I just want to know. Bye, Marjorie. Okay, now. Let's get down to business here. We have three more rooms to decorate. Now, let me get my little notepad ready. I feel like blue's close. Um, let me get my notepad ready. What, what are gonna be these other rooms? We definitely wanna do, well, I definitely wanna do a, I was thinking we need like a, we need like an actual like kitchen. We need like an actual kitchen. What's happening with the music? We need an actual kitchen where like the baking is actually happening. That should be one of those back doors over here. I also thought it would be cute to have like a cake tasting room i think that's what i'm gonna call it a cake tasting room a break room no breaks no breaks we're getting to work here um so a kitchen a cake tasting room, that's where like you would bring the clients and be like, okay, we're having a wedding, we're having 200 people, we want chocolate cake, strawberry frosting. So maybe it's like an office cake taste, office slash cake tasting consultation room. <laughs> I don't know. Um, and then should the other room be a bathroom is what I was wondering. A bookstore? I I've got a whole library for Belle we need to decorate too. That's going to be our bookstore. Unicorn girl, enjoy your lurk. Maybe this should be the bathroom. That's what I'm trying to work out. I feel like this is the kitchen. This is the office. Well, it could be an office or a bathroom. I feel like we should do a bathroom. We don't usually build too many bathrooms and it might be really super cute to make a pretty pink <laughs> bathroom. Although these rooms are massive. So how can we make, how can we make a bathroom that looks like it has like stalls in this game? A break, no, no breaks. This is the break room. I've never worked in a restaurant. I've never worked in a restaurant situation where we had a break room. A break room in a restaurant is like, here, go sit on the freezer. <laughs> There's no break room. You just go sit in the dining room. There's no break room. But come on now. So I think the other room is a bathroom. I don't know. Maybe we'll change our minds. That's my idea. Okay, we have three rooms to decorate. And I'm two hours in the stream. Okay, um. start with our cake tasting room okay slash office potentially maybe we'll just jump around the rooms and decorate them all at once sometimes I like to do that too okay first thing I know that needs to go in here use the wanderer shelves as dividers 
and no no doors in our bathroom. Just kidding. We'll have to get creative. We'll have to get creative. Uh, we've got four thousand moonstones. Nicely done. There you go. Y'all all crushed it, huh? Okay, like this? A must. Don't know how to make door. I don't know how to do a lot of things in this game. So we're gonna figure it out. Coffee table. We could have it like a cute lounge. Okay. With a pink L couch, maybe? Um, this. So this is like an office. an office I don't know we could also just have it as like a big tasting room I think it's a tasting room we could just have two couches in the back corners although I'm also feeling like we need a desk set up in here. Hmm. What would be a cute desk? There's no break room at my place of work either. Our staff room has a few lockers in it. Two toilet cubicles and hooks on the wall for coats. Did I mention it's a very, see? If you're in the restaurant industry, you are I you're very lucky if you have a break, a special break room. Cause usually it's like, eh, just fend for yourself. Honestly, you're lucky if you get a break working in the restaurant industry, because that's another thing. Uh that once I was not once I was not really working in the restaurant industry. Um, which only really happened recently. Um, that my boss was like, you know you can take a break, right? And I was like, oh, I get a break? Like, this is a foreign concept to me. I have never been told that I can go take a break. <laughs> it just, it's, it's not really a thing. Okay, I think that's too squishy with the door. Okay, not that, not that. I'm trying to make this like a very lush, posh place. Okay, I don't like the couch by the door. It's too squishy. This is where they bring out all the bells and whistles for you. They give you complimentary champagne. They're like, yes, we want you to be our client. <laughs> they really jazz, they, they give you all the tricks here in a, in a place like this. Make it very fancy for you. So that's what we need to do. Uh, maybe it makes sense for this to be here. I really kind of want it to be like front and center, but maybe that doesn't make sense. Maybe it could be like this. It could be like that. Okay, so I think we need a desk. What's a cute desk? Uh, I'm picturing one. I don't know what it's from. I'm just going to look in tables. Maybe 
Any theater I worked at didn't have an actual break room either. Plastic fold up table with fold up chairs. I mean, it's something. <laughs> Look at something. We'll take that. We'll take that. Uh, you know what? Maybe some. There are little pink chairs that go with this table too. With the couch, I mean. Um. Where are they? They're like little armchairs. I know I probably passed them again. Because the color doesn't look good. Regal desk from center. Oh, is that the blue one? Uh, wait a second. Oh, this is what I'm looking for. Okay, I'm, I'm still trying to figure out the... Uh, it's a bit harsh not having a place to properly sit. I... I... I feel like... In some industries. I'm not saying it's good. Got 1200. Did enjoy making the belt, so it was one of it. I feel the same way. I really enjoyed my build, and I feel like it maybe should have done better, but it's fine. I also had the thought of like, maybe this is too pretty. And not looking ancient enough. Oh. Maybe that. Where's this? Wait, this desk? What is the regal desk from Cinderella? I don't think I even have that. Is that an item from, what is the regal desk from Cinderella? I was gonna say, I think it's from this, it's from the Founders Packs, the Ultimate Edition, which I did not get. Rats. Well, well, snap. Thank you for the hydrate reminder. Dang. Okay, that's too bad. This one's not awful in here though I mean I kind of want to have multiple desks and have kind of like a cubicle workplace situation happening I think I only had that one right um, let's pull out these for our little desk chair. Right? This is where we're making our clients menus. Okay. Uh, so we'll have another desk. I don't know about the layout. Maybe this should be back here. Yeah. Maybe this should be back there. Okay, I think I'm gonna scooch these. I 
have another one of those desks, do I? Bakery turn out amazing. Oh, thank you, new. Uh, I'm glad you love it. That means a lot. Um, wreck it, Ralph. I'm gonna wreck it. Guys, thanks so much for 70 likes. Okay, we need another one of those. We need another one of those. Um, okay, wall. Wall, wall, wall. Let's see. We need to decide on the wall, the um, wallpaper and stuff. You know what? That's really where I went wrong yesterday was trying to do all that. And it took me ages to decorate. Okay, this doesn't want to line up. You have got to be kidding me. Okay, let's put that there. Okay, I definitely want... Definitely the cork board. Little cork board. Oh, wait. The motivational poster? <laughs> the motivational poster? Now that should be in your break room built. If anybody's making a break room, put that in there. That's on par. That's great. We could do shelves in this corner as well. <laughs> okay. The motivational poster is great in the workplace. Okay. Let's do our bulletin board. And I think I want to use the water cooler. Now feels like the time. Um, Monsters Inc. Hello, goodbye. You're late, you're late, you're late. <laughs> um, okay. A phone. I'm trying to make this look like a little bit of an office set up here so we can have a phone I mean it shouldn't be too cluttered and messy though because like they are bringing their clients back here so we gotta keep it kind of nice we'll have a water cooler uh one of the filing cabinets could be good is there one that's closed Maybe there isn't, I just don't have it. I guess I'll use this one. Just got the water cooler the other day with two toilets. Well, that's convenient for you. With all the water you're gonna be drinking. As the music sounds like it's pouring water. <laughs> okay, ooh, you could put something on top of this. don't love the filing cabinet. It's a little too grody. It's a little too grody right there. I do love that. That was really convenient for you. That was so nice of Scrooge. <laughs> okay. I feel like I, I, can, I can feel that this room is coming along the way I want it to. Might be a little bit of a stretch. Um, okay, I 
do want another desk. We do need a window. Uh, maybe we'll put the window here. And what kind of wallpaper? What wallpaper do we want to go with? Marjorie, welcome back. Should I do a side window here, maybe? Just to bring in some more light? That's kind of nice. Um, the water cooler is hysterical. I love it. I love that item. I don't know what I want to do in this front area. Maybe just put more tables displaying food. I love seeing the water cooler like there though. Hmm, I guess it's okay. Maybe I should just scooch it over a little bit more. Something like that. Have like tiny trash cans, do we? Well, it's not really a it's not really a break room. It's more of like this is an office where like the event planners would be. Do you know what I mean? This is like where they they book their clients who need like special baked goods, and then like you would come sit over here and like try the food. Does that make sense? I swear it's a thing. I swear it's a thing. There is a small, okay. I was like kind of picturing that in my head, but I couldn't remember, it's not a thing. Travis, welcome back. That's gonna look good in here. To be honest. Is there a clipboard item? Oh, like an es like they would totally have an espresso machine in here. For the clients to like really wow them. Let's take that. Laptop? Dun, dun. Still fancy. I mean, it's a fancy place. Okay, that looks horrible. I mean, uh, we can kind of get away with it, but the way the Laptop is kind of hanging off the table is stressing me out a little bit. Can I pick this phone back up, please? I guess not. I guess it's there. The Jack chalkboard. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Um... I feel like that should be on a table. Maybe flowers on the ends, like table. Oh, you can't put those on any tables though, really. Because they're four tiles. I guess they have to be on the floor. Okay, that's um, fine. We'll deal with it. It's fine. stays exactly how it is, I guess. All right. 
Um, let's try the same floor and wallpaper. Well, I don't know about the wallpaper, but floor I feel like should be consistent. Now the wallpaper we could do the brick. That worn brick was this one. Wondering if I should do, I kind of like it all just like that. I know it's kind of mix match, but I kind of like it. Um, the striped wall. Could even be this wall. I might just do the solid brick all the way around. Okay, now tables. Do you think Winnie the Pooh and Friends will ever be added to Disney Dreamlight Valley? I think there's a strong possibility. We've already been questioned about them. Oh, you know what would be in this corner? It would be something like this. Where's the big white covered table? But maybe be something like this in the corner, just showcasing like really fancy cakes. Or I could do more tables with food on them to try. Maybe I'll put the espresso machine in the kitchen. Maybe we would have cakes on the tables in the corner. Such as the birthday cake. Maybe Aurora's cake. Oh wait, I don't have any more to bake. Okay, let me save my game. I feel like I have not done that. Um, Going back to Winnie the Pooh, we have been questioned about um, Winnie the Pooh coming to the game in one of the surveys they put out. So I feel like we could potentially see Winnie the Pooh. Why not? Sure, why not? This is where all the couples in Dreamlight Valley come to have their wedding cake done. All their birthday cakes, they all come to Sav's. Sav's French Bakery. Can I still sit here? Oh, good. Okay. Um, let me put in a cooking station. Might also put in another window. Ooh, we could put it above the couch. Um, what else could go on the wall? What else? What else? 
Want the room? Oh, thank you! Um... I think it's... It's getting there. I don't think I want those. The layout of the room is like, oh my gosh, thank you. I kind of struggled a little bit with the layout. I kind of always struggle with the layout at first. That's generally the hardest thing for me. I really wish that we could put stuff on a diagonal because this table in the corner on a diagonal would be gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, cooking station. That's what I need to do. I need to stay focused. Gotta stay focused. Okay. Utilities. Stove. Okay, I think Aurora's cake is one tile. I think that might look cute on a table. Um, I kind of want to put the wedding cake on the other table, but I did put that in the front room. So was there any other big cake like that we would want to show off? I feel like the wedding cake just makes sense. I think it's going to be the wedding cake. Yeah, there's just nothing else as good and grand as the wedding cake. So it's fine. We'll reuse it. That looks so funny on this cooking stove. Okay. Um, we need, like, pieces of cake and stuff on plates to go on the table. Uh, where the little lounge area is. I like this one. It has, like, a little fork. Like, somebody's trying it. That's cute. A little banana pie. I'll take a slice. I'll take a slice. Um, again, the Charlotte cake. It's just so cute. Okay, definitely not the carrot cake. I really don't like carrot cake. What about cupcakes? Maybe cupcakes. I also think a couple of little like coffees out on the table could be cute. Um, where can I find those? I think they're in this one. Yeah, let's make two little coffees and just have those out on the table. Throw all this delicious food on the floor. <laughs> Imagine just throwing your wedding cake on the floor. That is savage. <gasps> Took your puppy on a walk and you encountered a snake. Is your dog okay? Did the snake try to mess with you or was it like, was it 
everything okay. <laughs> Throw it on the floor in 2024? Um, bye, Mrs. Flower. Thank you so much for being here today. Have a wonderful rest of your day. I think it might be raining in my valley. Unless that's the water cooler or the cooking stove. I feel like I hear something. There's no like clipboard. Is there like a tabletop clipboard item in this game? Cause I would love that for this table. Um. Oh, good thing your dog's okay and didn't also didn't try to harm the snake. Because that is not something I would want to be trying to break up. Your dog's only 10 pounds. Oh my gosh. Good thing everybody is okay, yourself included. Oh, binders. Binders could probably work on the desk and on the table. Like, the staff are taking notes on like that cake's trash. <laughs> the client hated it. <laughs> um, okay. Good call, good call. Appreciate it. Appreciate the suggestions. Um monster sing. She thought it was a branch. Oh, how big was the snake? I guess as big as a branch. Appointment binders. Blue pile of binders. <laughs> okay. Uh, what else? Okay, um, see, I don't know if that is right. Like, I don't want to have too much clutter out here. I know it's surprising that I'm saying that. Um, as someone who loves clutter and lots of it, but I feel like this room has to stay kind of pristine, you know? We're trying to wow our guests, make them want to, uh, you know, book with us. put this phone on the other desk and maybe a plant oh this the little cup of pens on the desk okay that's really cute and maybe a plant Do I want a pile of books on this table though? It's like a little bit too messy. What else? There's nothing really else like that though, is there? Aside from just like an open book. I really need a clipboard item. All right, little cacti would be oh so cute. Where is it? Uh, I think I want the red in the red cup. So let's go to Scrooge. We need to get another one of these desks. Um, some cacti. I'll swap the hydrangeas for the calathea. The scrolls? Um, I also had that thought, but I don't know. Mm, 
might be to... I don't know, just like... Out, dare I say outdated for this place? There's also this plant. I think I might do the Calatheus. Because I used those in the other room. Ginny, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing well too. Thank you for joining us. Um, no worries, Lana. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you. Thank you for the gifted membership and your continued support and amazingness and everything you do. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And I'm sure I'll I'm sure I'll chat with you later on. <laughs> I'm sure we'll be in touch, doll. Uh, ooh, little plant in the corner. That's my desk with the plants. The one with the plants? Yeah, that's mine. Don't touch. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good, sounds good. We'll be in touch. Uh, maybe there? I don't know, the hydrangeas are feeling a little... A little lost. All right, let me go to Scrooge. Also wondering if like a rug might be nice in there. I knew it was raining. Good thing we finished decorating outside. Oh, I didn't decorate Mama G's yard. I know I'm gonna hear about that later. She's gonna rip me apart. I've lived in this valley for over a year. This is the respect I get. I don't know how, I don't even know how to do a Mama G voice. I just know she's not gonna let me hear the end of it. Okay, I feel like with these little final touches, it's been a while since I've seen you. No, no! Have you ever heard Ariel sing? Oh, she has the most beautiful voice. I can't escape him in Scrooges, unfortunately. We need a mods emote. I, hang on a second um, while I look at while I look this up, um, just give me one moment. Um, I have a few emotes that we could add. I have an Alice in Wonderland emote ready to go. Um, but I don't think I can add, I don't think I can add another emote. I don't think we can add another emo yet. Let me let me see. Bum, 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 bum. Naomi, thank you so much for spending some time with us today. I hope you have a fabulous rest of your day. Um, let me take a quick Ganzar here. You know what's so funny is that the whole time he's doing this, you can't hear it. Why am I just envisioning him playing, I can't even say the name of it, that I know it as, but the saxophone song, like you know the one. If you know the one, you know the one. Like he's definitely jamming to that right now. Um, have you noticed he hasn't stopped? He knows that the camera's on him. Yeah, I can't add another emoji yet. 
but yeah I'm always taking notes of um, what emojis y'all want to see I know we need like a rain emote um, we can do like a little mod love emote I think that would be whoops didn't mean to do that honestly honest mistake nobody needed to do that some Kenny G is that the song I'm thinking of You know the one. You know the one. If you know the one, you know the one. You can hear it in your head, too, when he's doing that. Bro hasn't stopped. He's got some lungs. Let me let me take some water. He's tiring me out with, like, the lung capacity. <laughs> he hasn't stopped. He knows he's he knows he's on stream too. That is so bad. That is so wild, Eric. <laughs> okay. Um we are here for a table, Mr. Scrooge. We need a Carol's Is that the one? Is that the one I'm thinking of? I, I don't know the, I don't think I actually know the real name of the song. I know it by another name and I don't think I should say it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, this is the one. He's totally, <laughs> the one needs to edit. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even the right instrument. I don't care. It's so funny. <laughs> uh, okay. That's too much. Okay. He hasn't stopped either. <laughs> okay. What am I here for? I wish I could make a shopping list for Scrooges when I'm decorating. You're crying? I think I'm about to start tearing up myself. out of this menu he's still gonna be back there <laughs> no he's popping off <laughs> i need to play it in my headphones again hang on y'all i'm muting the i'm muting the low five for a moment because you need to pull up Just jam with Eric for a minute. Okay. There you go. He's still doing it. <sighs> okay. I'm melting. I'm... <laughs> that, that concert was too fire. Okay. I'm gonna put my fan on for a minute. Hopefully there's not too much background noise. It's too heated. The shell was too fire. Okay, I'm just gonna have the fan on for a little bit. So if you hear any um, noise from that, I'm so sorry. I'll turn it off in a moment. <laughs> Eric, we're not laughing with you. We're laughing at you, just to clarify. <laughs> Where is the little red potted cacti? I'm listening to the background. I'm officially crying. <laughs> okay, I'll turn that off. Okay. He's still doing it. How long do you think he'll sit there and do it? Oh. Okay, he gave up. <laughs> he just bounced in the corner. <laughs> 
I'm losing it. Imagine careless whisper, but it sounds like a record. Somebody please. Somebody please edit. Edit careless whisper into a flute version and put it over Eric. <laughs> right here. Somebody edit it. Right now. It's probably a thing. Uh, did we get everything? I, I can't. I'm done shopping. I can't shop. There's too much of a disturbance in this store, like, and I'm the problem. I'm some of the problem. I can't. I have to go. You know what? At least he's stuck in there. <laughs> Have I gotten to the point where I'm just delirious now? Maybe. Okay. Let's get back to business. Like I said, there's no breaks at this job, so. Flu boy loves being a disturbance. There's a video on YouTube called Careless Whisper played incredibly badly. <laughs> okay, so let's take that audio, put it over Eric playing his flute. <laughs> it shouldn't be this funny, but I really think it is. I just can't stand that man. Needed we all needed that laugh today, didn't we? I really need I really needed really needed that laugh today too. Thanks, Eric. Thanks for letting us laugh at you. That was an interesting song to come back on stream to. I'll make it a short. I'll I'll do what I can. Da -da 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 -da. Look, if I can't get like an original, if I can't get audio of somebody playing it poorly, I will just hum it and it'll sound terrible. <laughs> it would do no, it wouldn't, it wouldn't. But I don't really care. I think it's funny. On that note, for that reason, I'm out. Okay, so, so you're also, so what you're telling me is that I also cannot center this above the desk. I mean, I don't know why we try. Guys, I don't know why we try to make things centered in this game anymore. I don't, I give up. Why does it kind of sound like the lo-fi right now? <laughs> I can't. I'm going to start tearing up. Crying laughing. Okay. Cactus. Okay, let me get another laptop. How did I find that laptop? I guess with electronics? Is this one better? Oh, that one's worse. That one hangs off the desk worse. Oh wait, this one is like made for the desk. I think. That looks better than the than the laptop. I could put the laptop over here. Like this is what they're taking notes on. Oh wait, no, I can't. It's not on the table. 
Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Oh, I like that. Little double desk situation. Don't bother me in my cubicle kind of vibes. Okay. I'm losing it. Okay, rugs. Any rugs? Any rugs we want to pop in here? I think they're all going to be too small. And pointless. But... I swear I just got a purple rug. I swear I just got a purple rug yesterday. And now I don't see it. Interesting. I mean, this one's cute. But it kind of doesn't do anything. It doesn't really do anything for us. Okay, I think this room... <clears throat> no, let me just see if there's any last little bits we want to put on the wall over here. The little, yes, there was a purple oval rug, exactly. Where did it go? Look, I know I got it. It's documented on stream. I have witnesses. Where are the, where are the purple rug? Where's that purple rug? I don't, I don't see anything to put in the corner here, so I'm just gonna leave it. It's fine. Okay, there's that room. I didn't use that little purple rug anywhere yesterday though, did I? I only played on stream. I don't think I played at all after. I definitely didn't decorate. I didn't put it in front. Where did it go? Truly. Okay, we need to send send a search party. I don't know where the purple rug went, but I definitely got it yesterday. From the Mickey and Friends collection. That's rude. Okay. We're gonna make a kitchen and we're gonna make a bathroom. Um Oh my gosh, that just took an hour to do that room. Okay, it's fine. Um I think we're just in like a funny mood, so let's just make the bathroom. Okay. Um, cozy girl stuff. Hello, welcome in. We're 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 doing pretty good over here. I think we're in a. I'm I'm in a very silly mood now. All right, so. For the bathroom, someone said to try the Wanderer shelves. I can't remember if that's Toy Story or Lightyear, so let me find both. This? <clears throat> How are we gonna make bathroom Okay, maybe, okay, so this is what people are doing. We're making like fake walls with these. Is that what's happening? But then yeah, how can we make like a door? Oh, I ran out. Rats, okay. What could be used as a, a door? Honestly, you don't even really need to be able to see in there. We also would need something to put in between the stalls, I guess. I mean, I guess we don't. It's giving HHP wall dividers. I can't recall who just suggest who suggested that. But what could go in between as a door? 
something low and flat. Okay, bear with me. I mean, might pass off as a door to a stall, right? I wasn't even in here looking for that. I was actually gonna pull one of these out and put it in here. We could have like one of the doors open. Maybe, I don't know. So you could see it in there if you wanted to. I don't know. What about that? I, I don't know, it looks it doesn't look good on that angle, but it would definitely make you have to use the restroom, probably. Um, <laughs> let me get some more of these. And... Oh, what if... Yeah, I kind of like the ador idea of like maybe one of them is open so you can see the a toilet in it. And then it's like, oh, yeah, it's a bathroom. As if like anybody's coming in here. I mean, I don't know. Maybe you guys will come over and visit the bakery. <clears throat> okay, we need more of these things, unfortunately. Uh, and then I don't know what I would do to... Maybe all the stalls are closed. I don't know. Okay, this looks like it will probably fit perfectly. Oh, nope. Joke's on me. Okay. Uh... Maybe I try one... I don't, hmm. I guess you could get a ton of these and just put them all like that and make a wall. That's probably what I'll do. Okay. And then if we wanted a door open, the only thing is there's that fountain on the other side, which is kind of silly. Okay, but are these all gonna fit? Maybe we'll have one large stall. Okay, so we need a bunch more of those dividers. Okay, then we need like a sink area floor. Such a cool idea. Well, shout out to whoever suggested that. That was like way long, long ago. At the beginning of the stream. We've been through so much. I can't remember who suggested this. I'm so sorry. But credit to them. The brick all in here as well. Yes, this is the Sully sized restroom. It really would be nice to have one of the doors open.
Hmm. Don't know. Okay, so we need two more of those. Actually, I need a lot more than two to make them like walls. <clears throat> okay, then we need sinks and stuff like that. Um, hang on a sec. trash can I was looking for um okay too late for that maybe we'll do just the white white sinks so we need more of those um no that one's not right Okay, so we've got white sink we need more of. Um, some mirrors. And then is there? Another counter piece that goes in between these sinks, like one that doesn't have a sink. That matches. Oh, uh, this one, right? Okay, so something like this. Here's the other one. And then, well, I gotta go back to Scrooge's, unfortunately. Oh, this could work. That works. Maybe I'll just space these out more. Maybe I can fit this and that. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, so let's line this up. Very luxurious. Okay. Another one of these. Wait, it doesn't fit. Wait, how did I just have this so that it fit? Unless I can make the door look like it's open, but it's against the wall. Hmm. All right, let's hop on over to Scrooge's again. <clears throat> Yuri, welcome back. Is the cabinet? Was it because of the I moved the cabinet? I don't know. Okay, brace yourselves. We're about to go into another concert, guys. By the way, if you have not liked the stream already, please take a second and hit that like button. Please and thank you. All right, coast is clear. Oh, I don't want to hang out with you. Why did I do that? Furniture. 
Okay, utilities. Let's get more of these. Let's get some of these. Some of these. Some of these. Trash can. And we need the wanderer pieces. Um, do, do, do. I need a lot of these. I'm getting 50. That's too many, hopefully, but I want to have enough. I don't want to have to come back here. Bro, I'm not coming back. <laughs> I'm not coming back, Scrooge. What else can we have out in the bathroom? Plants. I feel like we don't have to do too much. Do, do, do. Thank you guys for hanging out. I appreciate y'all being here. Wait, not that. We're going in this room. Oh my gosh, you would think that I don't even own this place. I don't even know my way around. Maybe the, okay, let's just see how this works. Oh, the cabinet is in the way now. I can just push the stalls back, it's fine. Um, I would rather have the cabinet fit. All right, utilities. Let me get another sink out. So, I think I can find it in storage. Okay, so we've got that. What if it was like a sliding door situation? I'm really trying to make this work. What if the door opens into the stall like that? Oh, what if it's like that? Okay, now we're now we're thinking with a big brain here. There we go. There we go. It doesn't even have to line up because you're not even going to know. The door doesn't shut. How is that in line? That's in line? I guess it is. Okay. Jewel, welcome in. I hope your exam went well. Now you get to relax. Okay, so. Maybe this stall has its own sink in it as well.
that's why it's jumbo. Are these cabinets lined? I think they are. Ooh, hopefully though there's enough, hopefully this fits the way I'm putting them though. Like there's not a gap. Uh, oh my gosh, will one more fit? Okay, the way that just worked out. I just made my heart sing a little bit. Uh, okay, we don't need them there, I guess, but we will put them here. This is a classy place. Well, enjoy your playtime, Miss Queen. What do you plan on doing? Anybody do their um, dream snap already today? I'll probably do that next time. Okay, this is not lined up. This is not lined up. I'll probably do my dream snap next stream. bad it's not so bad guys I still feel like this is not lined up with these I think it's just playing tricks on me okay so we've got a stall here we need a little sink in this room as well I think that would just really sell it So let's grab another mirror. And a sink. Sink, sink, sink. That's that's pretty good. That works, y'all. All right, let's put more toilets in here. Okay, you can't center it. It's fine. Um, we'll put one of these in this one. Okay. Okay, now we need the trash bins. Where did they go? Here we go. trash can in here and then I guess by the door the pizza planet in the item shop is not a house skin it is an it's technically an item so you cannot decorate the inside of it unfortunately Okay, uh, I think just like plants. I don't think we have to do too, like anything too wild in here. Uh, I really wish I could put these on this. Too big though. Um, we have put lights. I didn't put any lights in that other room either. So we're gonna have to go back and do that eventually. Right, I'm gonna go with the trusty Calathias since I'm using this all over this building. Let's put these here. I mean, the 
good thing about it being an item is that you can order as many as you want. You could put them everywhere if you wanted to. Should we have one in the stall? Um, anything else that we would want to put in here? I'm not really too sure. Candles. I mean, it's like a fancy place. Bubble lights. Maybe in between. Kind of cool, kind of cool. And then what's some other kind of stuff we can put on the counter? Maybe, I guess, just plants. Wall art. What kind of wall art, though? Like what? That plant is just too big. It doesn't work for me. Oh, what about a, an orchid? That's classy. That's really classy. It's too bad it won't center. That's not classy. Oh, the little thing with soap in it? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, frozen. I hope I still have one. I know I used it in my ship. I think that was one of my last ones. Hopefully I have it in the other color. Here we go. Oh, that's perfect. Should there be one on either side of the sink? I guess why not? We need stuff. Okay, that's probably all for the counter. Good call with that one, Jewel. Um, anything I can put on the walls? Anything else? Do we want a window? <clears throat> what makes sense? And also kind of matches with the aesthetic. Uh, I feel like we could have a, just a window. Probably just a window here. And maybe, maybe a coat rack. <clears throat> Here's where we'll bring out that coat rack we've been trying to use. Not, look, the window's not into the stalls, guys. Um, coat rack, where are you? I've probably passed it. I've probably passed it. Oh, here it is. Cute bath. I mean, we kind of popped off with the fake stalls. It's very exquisite in here. Honestly, not a bad place to hang out <laughs> if you had to. Uh, do we want a little rug? What about, let me just see how these rugs look. What happened to that rug I had yesterday? I could do these. They might be oogly. They're kind of oogly. It's kind of gross. <laughs> I think it's kind of gross to have a rug in a public restroom. <clears throat> I mean, I guess it's, it's gender neutral. It's gender neutral in here. 
it just matches the bakery. But yeah, you can spin around and check out the whole room if you want, I guess. I think you can. <laughs> a couch? We could put a couch here. Maybe that small pink couch. Or, or maybe just a chair where you like sit and wait for your friend. And you're like, come on, I told you not to drink that extra iced tea. We're supposed to be having our meeting, our, our, our cake consultation. Thinking about getting a purple cottage. The purple cottage is fantastic. I don't think you'll regret getting the purple cottage. Oh, it's from the... I forgot about that. Now that you're saying it, I can hear it. I wasn't all that big into the Amanda show though. I think it was a little... I don't know, I just, I wasn't, I was more of a Disney kid, to be honest, than a Nickelodeon. At times, Nickelodeon felt like it was too, like, mature for me or something. And I just didn't really love it all the time. But I was more of a Disney Channel kid. Okay, the trash can. It's fine, it's whatever. Um, maybe just one little piece of something above the couch. What else here? Can't center it. Watch much Nickelodeon either, but I did love the Amanda show. Okay, this bathroom's kind of fire. I kind we kind of just popped off with the bathroom. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Fabulous. It's fabulous in here. It. What a transformation. Okay, y'all, we did that. We did that, huh? We sure did. All right, friends. I am going to end it here. I need to get ready um, to go out for the evening. Going out for a little dinner trivia fun <laughs> probably gonna go lose that trivia that's what I'm gonna do so no I'm gonna go win I'm gonna go win trivia guys hype me up about to go win um <laughs> looking great thank you hope look the place is coming along I still didn't finish it but I got a lot of work done today okay I got look in the time that I decorated two rooms and outside this bakery, today I had only decorated this one room yesterday. I was not having a good day yesterday. I just couldn't, my brain couldn't brain. Um, so we will decorate the third, the, the fourth and final room another time. Um, probably next stream and I'll also do my dream snap then as well. But 
the bakery has come quite a long way. So the other room is going to be the kitchen, which is going to be a big build. Um, so that's going to be back here. So it's like you come back behind the counter, kitchen's through this door. We've got our little cake client consultation party planning office area. I need to change the store. I need to order more of them. Um, we'll have the bake the the bakery kitchen through that door. And then obviously we have the, the main cafe area and our little bathroom, which is just so, so darling. I, I love how this came out. The fake stalls are kind of crushing it. And I, I love that technique now. That's so cool. I love the bathroom. You're gonna win at your, thank you. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. Thank you so much for 80 likes. We just hit two by the way. Thank you for the super chats, the new members, continued members, all the chatters, all the lurkers. I appreciate each and every one of y'all. I hope y'all have a fantastic rest of your Wednesday or whatever day it is for you when you're watching, to be honest. Um, let me take a quick gander. Uh, let me take a quick peek here. Um, oh, it's, it's Elle's birthday. Let's go wish Elle a happy birthday and go hang out, um, on stream. I, okay, we'll be redirected. Um, you'll be redirected. Just be sure to go over and say tea party raid. And subscribe to Elle. I believe Elle is playing Disney Dream Life Valley. So go subscribe over there. Let's go say hi. You guys are going to go um, be redirected. So be sure to like, subscribe, wish Elle a happy birthday. And I will be, I'm trying to be po better about posting my stream schedule. So look out for that on Sunday, I think is when I'll post it. Sunday or Monday. All right, friends, have a wonderful rest of your day. Let's go say hi to Elle. And thank you guys for being here. Okay, I'll see you later. Wish me luck at trivia.